December this year has had a few truly stupendous dawn lights. That was actually the same day, just looking in opposite directions. However, generally, it's been dank, pretty warm, quite windy, very wet. And, you know, the garden is actually looking quite lush and green, but we've had no magical frosts. We've had no kind of glorious sparkly days. So the, the video is a bit thin, it's going to have to be said. But we take our pleasures where we can find them. And, uh, you know, this Cotone Aster has been fantastic. I mean, you know, that's with probably half of the berries gone. It's been amazing this year. But it's also the time of year where you start to see all the new seedlings coming through and looking ahead at the, the early growth for next year, which is a very exciting process. But you're also enjoying last year's seed heads and uh, the, the mix of textures and the, the soft foliage. I mean, probably if we get a sharp frost, this Melianthus will struggle, but at the moment it's happy. But the heathers are in their prime and they're such a, they're a great small innocuous plant. And yet with the closer you get, the more detail you see, and it's just a lovely, lovely spot of colour at some of year. Spots of colour. There's the odd rose clinging on there for dear life. But generally at some of year, the effect is more around the forms, the structures of the pots. And the use of the evergreens, which in this bit by the kitchen, I've got a whole load of evergreens in those pots. And it's, it's, it's a lovely thing. And the way these box blobs frame all the raggedy non-cut down bit beyond is uh, is lovely and the view across to the new pond you know we've just got to get that little glimpse in there you know pretty soon that will all start to grow and we'll see much less of it but at the moment it's fabulous this euphorbia has been a absolute delight yet this year but it's obviously quite a fussy plant because while this one is very happy this one about five feet away i think is too wet but December and the winter is a time for looking at plans and enacting changes. And we are just reshaping the edge of this bit of lawn, which hopefully is my last bit of major earthworks, but that'll be happening soon. But of course, December was time to have Christmas with all my family. <laughs> 